So in this video, you'll learn how to enable or disable screen auto-rotate on your Samsung Galaxy S25. So the first step when it comes to enabling or disabling this feature is to access the quick settings. To access the quick settings on your S25, you want to swipe down from the top right corner of your screen. From here, you should see this mini quick settings panel. So to view even more options, you just want to drag on this handle to drag it down so that you can see your full quick settings menu. Then you want to look for this option, auto rotate, and when it's enabled, it will glow in a white color. And so now with it turned on, it means I can switch the screen of my phone to either landscape or portrait, just depending on its orientation. So let me start by opening an app. And currently you can see it's in portrait mode. To switch to landscape, I can just put my phone in landscape mode like this. And then when I put my phone back down, you can see it switched orientation to landscape mode. So now I can start using the screen in landscape mode. Again, if I want to switch back to portrait, I can just put my phone in portrait and then it will switch back to portrait mode. If you want to turn it off because you're tired of your phone that because you're tired that your phone keeps switching orientations when you don't want it to, then just go back to access the quick settings panel. And then just tap on that icon like this. It will gray out showing that screen auto rotate is turned off. And now whenever you open an app and you try to put your phone in landscape orientation, it won't switch. It will just stay in its uh, locked form, which is portrait. Bear in mind that some apps will not be able to switch between orientations. For example, if you have any games installed and the orientation is naturally set to portrait mode, then even if you switch to landscape, the app won't switch to landscape. And so that's how you can enable screen auto rotate on your Galaxy S25. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.